Next trait is a cooperation between state-owned National Enterprise Corporation and the United Arab Emirates Trade Group, a company involved in the production of military armored vehicles. Last evening, President Museveni told visitors at the commissioning event that what has been developed has addressed a number of problems. So here, we have seen this group. They have turned insecurity into an opportunity. They provide an answer for every type of insecurity. These vehicles, as you can see, they will solve many problems. The rich people who want to armor their cars, ah, there is the capacity here. The president said the armored car plant will generate income for the country and save on military expenditure. If you see how much Africa is spending on importing weapons, it's a lot of money. So by manufacturing them here, we are going to save a lot of money but also create jobs and capacity for our people. I will no longer allow buying from uh, other sources when this capacity is here. He commends the NAIC executive for following his advice. Sometimes I give guidelines and the people I tell don't follow up. But these ones follow up. I'm very happy with that. The chairperson of Straight Group pledged to support government in creating jobs. The country is very peaceful and we wish you to keep that way and we will do anything to help you out with that, to keep your people happy, create more jobs, train your people and bring very happiness, big happiness to you. Also important to note is that this entire factory was built by our own NAIC Construction Works and Engineering Company, which is a subsidiary of NAIC, engaged in the field of construction, utilizing the engineers of the UPDF. The Chief of Defense Forces, General Wilson Imbadi, stressed the importance of enforcing the Buy Uganda, Build Uganda policy to promote locally made products. We produce things here. I think there is a need for a, this policy to be seriously paid attention to so that uh, we save our hard and currency. The armored infantry fighting vehicles will be sold to other countries in the region. Aaron Mukama, NTV.